In this video, I'll share with you seven investing habits that can help you become a successful investor. If you're new to my channel, I work as a finance manager at a top tech company with an MBA in finance and a CPA designation. I've been in the finance industry for the past decade and want to share everything I've learned so far with you on my channel. Let's start with the first investing habit, which is the most important one and many people overlook it. Investing habit number one, buy what you understand. Don't listen to personal finance influencers who give you random stocks and promise you that you'll make huge returns quickly. Instead, focus on the products you know and use in your everyday life. If you shop at Costco every week, consider buying their stock. If you can't imagine your life without your iPhone, you could also invest in Apple stock. There are hundreds of other examples like this and I think you get the point. By investing in companies whose products or services you personally use, you can invest with more confidence and you can sell your stock at any time that you start becoming dissatisfied as a customer. And that's exactly how rich people invest. They don't put their money into anything they don't like or understand. Investing habit number two, diversify. Don't put all your eggs in one basket or in this case, don't put all your money into one stock. If that company starts losing money or goes bankrupt, you'll lose all your investment. Instead, you should make sure to diversify your investments. This means to invest in different companies and also in different sectors. Don't only invest in technology companies, for example, because the tech industry overall can experience an economic downturn and you could lose a lot of your money. Diversify by also investing in retail companies, financial companies, real estate companies, manufacturing companies, and others. This will ensure that your money is protected and growing, even if some companies or sectors experience declines. Investing habit number three, stop day trading. Day trading is a form of gambling. Day trading is when you buy and sell the same stock within the same day with the hope of making a small profit. You're way more likely to end up losing all your money instead of making any money. Day trading is super risky and there are some large financial companies that invest millions of dollars a year to build algorithms that can day trade for them. So it's impossible for people like us to compete with them now. Instead of gambling your money away on day trading, focus on long-term investing strategies that are proven to be successful over time. You'll never hear me promoting day trading on my channel and remember that there's a good reason for that. Investing habit number four, stay informed. Stay updated with the latest financial and political news and trends. If you can understand how current events can impact the financial market, it can help you make better investment decisions. Make sure to spend some time each day to read financial news, watch market analysis videos, and follow reputable finance experts on social media. When you listen to someone's advice on social media, make sure that they have the right credentials and experiences. Investing habit number five, reinvest your dividends. When you get dividends from your investments, don't just pocket the money. Reinvesting dividends allows you to compound your returns over time, which leads to exponential growth in your investment portfolio. Each dollar that you make in dividends from the stock market can be put back into the stock market to make you more dollars over time. Most investing apps give you the option to automatically reinvest your dividends, so you don't really have to do anything if you have that turned on. Investing habit number six, Stay patient. Successful long-term investing requires a lot of patience. Don't panic and sell your investments during small market downturns. It's very normal for stock prices to fluctuate and go up or down in value in the short term. Instead of panicking, stay calm and stick to your long-term investment plan. History has shown that markets tend to recover from downturns and patient investors get rewarded in the long run. Investing habit number seven, rely only on yourself. While it's okay to ask for advice and learn from others, remember that ultimately, you are the only one responsible for your investment decisions. Take the time to educate yourself about investing principles, strategies, and potential risks. I'll also be covering all this on my channel if you're interested in learning more. But trust your own judgment and do your own research before you make any investment decisions. By relying on yourself, you'll become a more confident and successful investor in the long term. I hope you found this video helpful and that all of you become successful long-term investors. Thank you for watching this video and I'll see you in the next one.